What's up, my homies? If you're interested in looking like a fresh and icy goddess for the holidays and winter months, then look no further. This is a very simple, easy makeup tutorial on how to do just that. I wanted my makeup look and my eyeshadow to be as icy as my heart and soul. Just because we're in the middle of the apocalypse doesn't mean our makeup can't look cute. This is a great makeup look for when you're planning on just hanging out with the fam at home and not really planning on doing much, but still want to feel the holiday cheer with some fun eyeshadow. So what I've done so far, I already put foundation on my face and then covered up my eyelids with some MAC Painterly Paint Pot for a base for my eyeshadow. And then I'm going in with a matte eyeshadow color that matches the color of my skin tone and putting that all over my lids to create a base for the blue color that I'm going to use next so that it blends nicely. So I'm barely patting into that bright blue color from my favorite Visart palette and just putting a little bit of that over top of the skin tone matte eyeshadow that I already put on. And both of these are matte eyeshadows so they will blend perfectly. Also, I barely put on any foundation. I really wanted this makeup look to look fresh and not like I'm wearing a full ass face of makeup because I'm not hitting the club. I'm literally going to hang out with my parents and chug wine. Holler. So I'm working to basically create a light blue eyeshadow color by mixing a tiny amount of my bright blue eyeshadow and the skin toned matte eyeshadow that I have. And mixing these two will really create a fluffy, icy look that covers your eyelids but isn't too intense. It just looks like a really light wash of icy blue and I think it is absolutely perfect and fresh looking for the holidays and the winter months. Loving it. So just going back and forth with a super fluffy brush with these two colors. Mix that shit up. And my derp face, because I'm not really sure what I'm doing half of the time. I'm pretty much usually just winging it. I don't normally plan out my makeup looks. So kind of just threw this together and was hoping that it would look fine. And I think this really shows how versatile the Visart palette is. I mean, it has such bright colors, but look at this very light eyeshadow look that I made with it. It's something that you probably wouldn't think that you could do looking at how bright the colors are on their own. I am really layering on this mascara and the best part is that it still looks great. This mascara layers really well. Continuing to layer, just constantly layering over and over, layer upon layer. The more I say layer, the weirder this word sounds. I feel like you can say any word over and over and then by the end of it, you're like, the fuck even is this word? All right, I think I've lost track of how much layers I'm actually doing on this mascara. And normally I would probably edit this out, but I wanna show you the raw footage of the layering and really how many times you have to layer to make it look like your eyelashes are super layered with the mascara. Here I'm using a clean Q-tip to clean up around my eyebrows. And now for the fun part going in with a champagne pop all over my face to really make myself feel like an icy goddess. I'm not using blush or contour for this look, wanted to keep it simple and glowy just with the highlighter. Sometimes all you really need is some sparkly shine all over your face. Really adding to the nonchalant vibe of this overall makeup look by sort of blending it in with my hands. Kind of just doing things here and there pretty casually and doing nothing really too extravagant to create this fresh makeup look, not doing too much layers of makeup, not doing anything too much, except the mascara, of course, but overall keeping this look fresh, clean, and icy. A quick dance of approval because the makeup look is turning out decently. I wanted to complement the rest of my makeup look with a natural colored lip, so I'm going in with Jeffree Star Birthday Suit, which is also a matte lip color, which will complement my matte eyeshadow perfectly and also contrast the highlighter I have all over my face. 
so that part of my face is super shiny and part of it is matte, which will create a nice contrast. Just rubbing that in with my finger to give a cloudy appearance around my lips so that it doesn't look my, like my lips are lined. And then adding some extra powder to my T-zone because I'm oily as a bitch and in the last five minutes since I put foundation on, I already got oily. Crazy. Don't want my T-zone to look just as shiny as the highlighter that I put on my face. Not cute. Gotta powder that shit up. And yes, it really is as simple as that. Just a few layers of makeup later and I'm feeling ready for the holiday season. Even though the world is fucked, just a few layers of makeup brighten my spirits and make me feel ready for the holidays. Thanks for hanging, guys. See you bitches next time.